My dear cousin, come closer and tell me what brings you... Uh, Constantine, is it true? Are you in great pain? This sickness is horrible, believe me. Now I understand what your mother went through. But you have not come to hear my complaints. Speak, it will give me something else to ponder. Allow me to present Afra, an emissary of the Bridge Alliance. She is an eminent naturalist who studies local flora in an effort to find a remedy. Your Excellency, it is a great honor. You were part of Governor Buren's lost expedition, if I've understood correctly, were you not? Yes, and our research would have borne fruit if it hadn't been so brutally interrupted. I can only imagine. Nevertheless, you are most welcome. Your great learning will certainly prove useful. I implore you, my dear cousin. Do continue. We are eager to hear your news. I wanted to inform you of our progress made in the attempt to discover a cure. As you advised, I followed the leads shared by our allies, none of which led anywhere. However, they both pointed in the same direction, towards a sort of god that the natives worship. They call him En Onmil Fruchtemann, the god of many faces. He is very powerful and protects the island. How can you be sure that it's not some sort of myth? Even a superstition? I saw it with my own eyes take shape during a ritual. It is possible that the Malachor is the expression of its vengeance. You are referring to the secret we unearthed. The entire continent is paying today for the errors of our grandparents. It is a terrifying perspective. But if it were true, he must also be able to help us heal. Princess, could you shed some light on this being? Is it possible to meet him? All the Donegada know him. He is the strength, the spirit of Tirfredi. You were looking for a demon or a remedy from plants, so I did not think of him. But yes, he is very powerful and as old as our world. He could surely heal your sickness, but it is not simple to meet him. Impossible, I would think. Though it is not my place to judge, you need to earn the trust of Glendan, the Elder of the Council. Ask him for his help. I beg you, cousin. Go and find Glendan. Do all that he requires. Offer him all that he desires. I don't know how much longer I can hold on. My life is in your hands. And those of so many others. I will do all in my power. I have already promised you. Where can I find this Glendan? He lives in the village of Dorhad Genadu. It is in the heart of our island, at the entrance to our most sacred lands. Thank you for your help, Princess. I will not forget the numerous services you have provided for us. And thank you, dear cousin, for everything.
steward. Hello, my name is Desardé. I am the legate of the merchant congregation. May I enter? Good day, legate Desardé. No, this building is closed to Renaixe. I am Siora, daughter of Vladne, daughter of Meb. My mother, the Mal of the Red Spears, was a member of the council. All here remember, and the Vorst Tirse. She was a courageous Mal. But you are not yet Mal in her stead, and you do not carry her seal. I am sorry, Siora. I cannot allow you to enter. I beg your pardon. I did not know. If I cannot enter, perhaps you could tell the Elder of the Council that I request an audience. Glendon cannot speak with you, Legate. Times are difficult, and his time is precious. He only accepts to meet the members of the Council or their representatives. How can I prove that I am the representative of one of them? If you are a trusted friend of a Council member, he will give you his seal, and we would know it. I will then be glad to allow you to enter. You would be the first Renaixe to obtain such an honor. I will return later. If you have a seal, you will be welcome. If not, you are wasting your time and mine. You have returned. If I cannot enter, perhaps you could tell the elder of the council. Glendo, how can I prove? If you are, I will. Die. I will return later. If you have a. Bird tear to man. Bird tear to man. Esquitu. Renaixi. Bertir to mud. Bertir to mud. You are on all Manawi. Bertir to mud. Good day, on Third tier to mud. Esquitu.
You should speak to Mom. I do not know anything. Leave me alone. I do not want to We find it hard to believe that you are My sister has disappeared. I am certain that the Loyans are behind her disappearance. And they abducted so many people from the villages. I hope we will make them pay. I need to craft a new spear for my son. Greetings, Katasak. We're tear to mud. What can I do for you? I'm looking to meet Enon Mil Frichtemann. I went all the way to the village council. But they did not let you speak to Glendan the Elder. Precisely. They said that only the friends of a member of the council might enter. And my word was not enough. It seems that I must be a mal to be heard. Do not be sad, daughter of blood, Ned. One day, you will be as great a chief as your mother. And you too will have a seal. This seal will allow you to give voice to the friends of your clan. Those who may speak in your name. Here, friend of Wen Xavier, take my seal and go and meet Glendan. But you must convince him and no doubt pass many trials. Many monsters and traps are hidden on the path you seek to follow. Thank you, Katasach. Why are you helping me? We do not wish to lose the one who placed his life in my hands. And you have already shown me your friendship. I hope that Glendan will allow you to meet this god, cousin. Leave as soon as you can. Godspeed. Have no fear. I'll do whatever it takes. I must go. What? You have returned. Here is the seal of the Denegad Katasach, of the village of Wen Xavier. And so you are a trusted friend of the great healer. He must see your true face and find it worthy. Enter. You are welcome.
I give you warm greetings, Glendan. I am Desarde, legate of the Congregation of Merchants. Your merchant congregation sways me very slightly from my part. But you are a current of Katasach. His trust in you makes me stop and look at you. What brings you here? I seek a remedy. My cousin, as well as many other people on our island, suffer from a terrible sickness. We think that only Enon Miel Frichtemann can help us find a cure. Really? And Katasach sent you to see me? He told me that the only way to meet with your god was to come and see you. You would judge our worthiness. Judge your intentions? Yes, that I can do. But even if I should do this, you would have many trials to pass. For the path you seek to follow has only been tread but a very few times, and you are the first Renaixe to set foot upon it. We must begin where everything begins. There is a trial, the trial of water. It will show us the reflection of your soul. What must I do? You must go to a cavern and tell me what you see on the seal you will find deep in its center. And this cavern is guarded, I suppose? That is true. But the simplest solution is not always the best. It is a path with many forks. I hope you will prove that you understand the spirit of our people and our island. Go now. Show us your true face, and return purified by the waters of the cavern. I must leave. Qua Awil. You have spoken to Glendon as you wanted. What more can I do for you? I was asked to pass the trial of water. What do you know about it? I have never passed it. Only those who must reveal their soul walk this path. The High Kings and Queens, it is a tremendous honor given to you, Renaixe. Do you have any advice to give me? I only know that the trial can be passed in many ways, and your choice will reveal the makings of your soul. One way is through strength, the other by ruse and heart. But I know no more than this. The trials are kept secret. Anything else? Nothing else, thank you. I need- Good luck. Siora, do you know anything about the trial that awaits us inside? My mother passed it during the last election, but it was Vinbar that was elected in the end. Did she tell you about it? A little, but it is a secret trial. It is important that you give your whole heart to it. I know that you must choose your path in your way. Combat is not necessarily the best response, even if it allows you to get to where you are going. If you are confronted with animals, remind yourself that they must feed. And there are ways of altering food to make those who eat it fall into a deep and peaceful sleep. Hmm. Is that an idea that your mother used? It's clever. Thank you.
You were freezing and you had this empty stare. The water in the basin spoke to you, no? Yes. Exactly like the lightning struck tree. I was something else for a brief moment. Tell us. Visions like this are guides, keys for the sacred rituals. I was in the sky. I was floating, carried by the wind. And it was a cold feeling. I was high up, and it was getting colder and colder. I felt my blood freezing in my veins. I fell to the ground and spun slowly. And then the sun warmed me. Suddenly I bounced on the ground. And I was taken by the bubbling current of this creek. Then, just like before, the vision dissipated. And I was suddenly with you again. On this stone, this, the drawing on this step, this drawing looks like, here this looks like, a, this stone is adorned with, the, this stone is blackened, eaten away. I think it's supposed to evoke death. This stone bears the image of a storm, or perhaps the wind. Once again, these visions open gates. Try to remember them. I was in the sky. I was floating, carried by the wind. And it was a cold feeling. I was high up. I must have lit the candles in the wrong order. Could you remind us of what... In the exact order. I was in the sky. I was floating, carried by the wind. And it was a cold feeling. I was high up, and it was getting colder and colder. I felt my blood freezing in my veins. I fell to the ground and spun slowly. And then the sun warmed me. Suddenly I bounced on the ground. And I was taken by the bubbling current of this creek. Then, just like before, the vision dissipated. And I was suddenly with you again. Blood, my friend. Do you... I must. Carantz, do you need something? I must pass the trial. I have heard what my mother. Did she tell you? Ali, I know. Come back if you are and there. Hmm. Anything else? What do you I will. I hope do you. Do not. Anything. I've never heard what happened. My mother. Anything. I'm asleep. This must be the seal that Glendan spoke about. It looks like the silhouette of the mountain of Tirfredi. And a face is drawn within it. The spirit of the volcano. One of the faces of Einon Mir Frichtemann.
Bear tear to mud on all Manawi. I congratulate you for passing the trial. Enter. And so you have returned. Can you tell me what the seal deep within the cavern brings into your mind? A face in the mountain of Tirfredi. Then you have seen the true face of the island when looking into her waters. And the island has seen inside you. You have given the blood of the animals that protected the entrance to the passage. You have chosen strength a first time. In choosing the path of silence, you avoided confronting the Dosantats. Finally, you have completed the ritual. And in so doing, the Guardian recognized you as a wise man. You choose to trust the way of rules and wisdom. It is a difficult path, but it carries generous fruits. The island has seen your intelligence and also your compassion. The friendship of Katasach towards you no longer surprises me. Am I authorized to encounter Enor Mil Frichterman now? To present him with my request? If the High King agrees, yes. We shall not oppose that decision. Only a High King or High Queen is allowed to open the sanctuary. I warn you, your voyage is far from over. I suppose that I'm going to need to convince them as well. Where can I find them? I do not know. And I believe that it may be another trial on your path to find the one you seek. Is he hiding? Has he been captured? He disappeared several months ago. Since then we have not heard from him. He was worried about the Renaixe. The last people to have seen him, I'm told, were the most important chiefs of the clans here at the council. There was Dedra, Blatnid, Ulan and Dunkas. My mother, alas, can tell us nothing more. Yes, I heard about your loss, Yora. And the worst, Tirse. Morning is a difficult time to pass. And the worst, Tirse. Thank you, Glinda. Dedra is the mal of the clan of the Storm Warriors. You will find her in the village of Vedlug. I've already met her. She sent me to confront a guardian. That sounds like her. Ulan is the mal of the village of Vignamri, near the coast. It is said that he welcomes the Renaixe. As for Dunkas, he leads the Vigigidor. He is the chief of the Earth Healers. His village is not very far from the Didekid and Nadages. Very well. I will go and see them. Try to find this High King. Thank you, Glendan. Kwaawalamsek. I hope that you will find him. Lieutenant, I demand an explanation. Tell us what is going on. We haven't heard anything about Lord Dorsey's condition in spite of our inquiries. We are extremely worried. And then, all of a sudden, one of his guards appears, shaken and on his own, though he is part of his retinue. Please, allow me the chance to shed some light, my lady. Your soldier is nothing more than a coward for abandoning his highness. Tell me. What is going on? This soldier has just reported in. 
He is asking for reinforcements. He believes that Lord Dorsey has been attacked. He believes? He ran here without full knowledge of what happened firsthand. I... I was sent on patrol far from the camp. But I heard screams from men and from beasts. I wanted to return to camp, but then I heard a deafening sound. Grinding like a landslide. I thought then it would be best just to go and get help. Thank you, Lieutenant. You are dismissed. I would like to have a discussion with this man alone. Yes, sir. My lady, could you lead these fine people into the hallway, if you would be so kind? Certainly. I deplore this embarrassing turn of events. But know that you have my full support in all circumstances. In the interest of avoiding a general panic, tell me precisely what happened back there. Your cousin ordered us to escort him beyond the town limits. The islander convinced him to go on some journey. By islander, do you mean the Denegad that came to treat his affliction? Yes. A, a strange bird. Missing more than one feather, you ask me, sir. I, I was ordered to set up patrol along a small path, rather far from the rest of the company. I was told to protect our perimeter from anyone wandering along. According to the islander, it was the only access to their planned destination. I did my rounds for quite some time. Not a soul came along. But then I heard cries a ways off, and I went running to help. I heard an enormous crashing sound, li like an avalanche of rocks. So then I turned right back around. And you ran all the way here? Do you know precisely where the company was when you heard these sounds? No, not precisely. I hadn't gone there. But I could show you where I was posted. The islander said they were following the path. But he was quite a ways ahead when I lost sight of them. Why didn't you go and look for yourself? To see if they had been buried by a rock slide? What? Alone? What could I have done? It seemed of greater urgency to go and get help. I'm still having trouble deciding if cowardice or intelligence got the best of you. But that's a question for your superiors. My cousin was quite weak. Do you know why he decided to follow the Denegad? His Highness was feeling much better. The potions that he was drinking must have been potent. I mean to show no disrespect to His Highness, but that islander had the high ground in the War of Wits. I wasn't privy to their counsel. I haven't the beginning of an explanation for the expedition, but your cousin was all full of enthusiasm and ordered that we set out as quick as we could make ready. That sounds like him. What sort of mess has he gotten himself into? Again. I am sorry, sir. But I don't know anything else I could tell you. Dismissed, soldier. Looks like I'm going on an expedition. Thank you, sir. <laughs>